The armature is the central part of your power tool's motor. It consists of windings, the commutator, a cooling fan, the drive shaft, the bearings, and the speed control magnet. The armature along with the field create an electromagnetic field that causes the armature to spin. The carbon brushes transfer electricity to the armature through the commutator. Over time, the commutator will wear from this constant contact. If the tool is overloaded, the armature can overheat and the insulation around the windings will burn away, creating a short circuit. When this occurs, Occurs, there will be excessive sparking from the motor brushes and smoke or a burning smell from the motor. Replacing the armature is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Soka. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless grills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the brushes from the motor. Now we'll remove the gear head. And the armature. Now we can install the new armature. I'll install the armature into the housing first. As I slide it in place, I'll align the tabs on the metal plate with the slots in the housing. Once it's in place, I'll reinstall the gear head. and I'll secure the gear head with the screws. And now I'll reinstall the brushes. And that's all it takes to install a new armature in your power tool. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.